Next trick I'm going to teach you is called Shock Wave. Um, shock Wave uses Magic Drop, um, which I just taught you in the last segment. So if you haven't looked at that video yet, take a look at that. Try and figure it out. Try and learn it, um, because I'm just going to throw that into Shock Wave um, and expect you to know it. So Shock Wave looks like this. Starts with a Magic Drop. Comes on the back string. Twist your hand in and come back. What's really cool about Shock Wave is if you practice enough and get this really smooth, it's a really nice flowing looking trick. It just comes back and forth, it's going in between your fingers, and it really flows if you practice enough. So that's shock wave, what I was just doing there. Now let me break it down for you. The first step is a magic drop. You hold it like this, start with the magic drop position, and perform a magic drop. Then you take your throw hand right pointer finger and you twist it in toward yourself. So it looks like this to this. What you're going to have there is two strings. You want to land the yo-yo on the string closest to your body. You take your non-throw hand pointer finger and you push into these two strings, landing the yo-yo on there. You can drop that then and you're right back in the magic drop position with your right hand. Let me show you again. So it's a magic drop. You land it on like that, twist in toward yourself, and then using your non-throw hand pointer, pulling like that. Let me show you from this angle real quick. Magic drop, land on to here, twist in toward yourself, and push into those strings. That's the whole trick. You just simply repeat. So it's magic drop, twist, magic drop, twist, magic drop. And if you repeat that, that's the entire trick itself. I believe in competitions, um, you do this three times. So one, one, two, three. That's shockwave.